the first feeling of the race course is very good, very fast, long back straight there, and then you have the little bit tighter section here. Today we return to the People's Republic of China for the first time in four years to the capital city of Henan province, and we bring you the BRM qualifying and the battle for pole position. Conditions are, are really, really challenging for all of the drivers. Figure out what I want propeller-wise if the, if the water stays like this, if the wind comes down, I have a plan too. So we feel ready for, for qualifying, now we just gotta go get and it done. You know the veteran from Norway is gonna come out pounding here in the final moments. Advance off, launch it, here we go. This we've seen this so many times in the last day or so. He flies the boat up, he stuffs it into the water very, very hard. And that was one and a half times around, Jonathan. That the wind is shifting a little bit back, more toward the driver's face. It's getting away from the west, heading more now toward the south. Hopefully holding his breath here with less than 30 seconds to go, and Celio's on the fly. Checkered flag has come out. He goes Jonathan. to the top, Jonathan. Sean Torrente with a 45. And changing it now. Jonas Anderson is officially given the pole position with a 45 7 8. Congratulations to the Swede. Peter Moran will up. 20 drivers from 12 different nations get set to engage in a battle of supremacy on water at the second round of the 2023 World Championship. They're underway and they explode away from the dock and 10,000 horsepower comes roaring at you as they head down toward the commitment buoy. Working his way into a position where he's gonna try to start catching up to some back markers. He's not there at that point to fly. Oh no, Bartek's out of the race. Oh, we've lost the Chinese driver. We've lost another driver, the rookie. What a shame, three boat battle going on. Philip Rump desperately trying to hold off Eric Stark. Zanderberg enlisted in the top three. Last lap here, the final lap, and Jonas Anderson from Sweden will come across and take the checkered flag. So the veteran 